Veterans Day gives Americans the opportunity to remember the hundreds of thousands of men who gave their lives in service to the country. But the holiday was also created to remember the living veterans, who oftentimes don't get the recognition they deserve. A lot of times people get out, you know, go on, and they're just forgotten and lost, you know, move on down the line. Abra Mosca, who's been out of the Coast Guard since May, is in the VA hospital in Hampton undergoing tests. And he says he can't believe how some of the vets are forgotten. There's guys in here that are, have been in here for weeks and haven't had a visitor, haven't had nothing. All they do is just sit there and talk to each other, you know. And they're 60, 65 years old. They don't have nothing. They don't have nobody. Walter Stevens, on the other hand, is a 29-year veteran who lives at the VA hospital and looks upon Veterans Day as a time to remember. He's upset that the holiday has become so commercial. Stevens, who won the Silver Star in World War II for repairing communication lines that saved his battalion, was shot just after the repairs were finished. All he says he can remember is waking up in the ambulance. I remember I was bleeding very bad. No pain, but I was bleeding. Stevens says he was lucky because many of his buddies never made it. And that's why the former master sergeant gets so irritated when people forget the veterans. He says it's a slap in the country's face. You've got to respect the country you live in. And anyone in this country thinks that we don't have the freedom, let them go to another country. Mike Deason, Area 10 Eyewitness News.